We're definitely uh, really excited to get going here. Um, Saturday is going to be big uh, for our first one against Post. You know, our mission is to get better every single day. And I think if you can do that and you're good enough, you're going to be successful. And, you know, we showed that and proved that last year, that if we kind of buy in and believe in the process and stick together, we can be really, really successful. It's really helpful for the team to have a big group of uh, leaders, not just upperclassmen, but we've got, uh, we've got a good group of guys that have uh, good culture and whatnot um, that all lead together. So not only the upperclassmen, but the rest of our team has kind of come together. Um, we're all buying into the same thing, so everybody's, everybody's leading and everybody's getting the job done. You look at the senior class, they've had a lot of success. You know, they've won the ECAC championship. They've been to the NE10 playoffs three years in a row. They made the NCAA tournament. You know, a lot of people, you know, would be ecstatic about that. The one thing I like about this group is they want more. Because we love knowing every week we're going to face high-level opponents. So if you don't bring your A game, you're going to struggle. So I think in a way the NE10 brings out the best in our players. It's a challenge that we look forward to. We want to be playing the best teams. Um, throughout the season so we can we can get better we can challenge ourselves and be against the best so uh, we look at it as a cha look, look at it as a challenge um, that we uh, that we look forward to every second of this year we're going to enjoy it and cherish you know their opportunities but it's up to them to leave a legacy you know just looking at the numbers on paper they've done a very good job of that and I'm excited to see what they can add this year to that there's a lot of expectations for us but uh, we'd like to just focus on ourselves and uh, kind of we've got high hopes and big plans so we're taking a lot of time to get prepared for that and uh, we're going to hit the ground running.